Good morning, YouTube. So, I'm just getting my day started with the best shit. Well, it's been a while since you guys see me do a vlog to set a Sunday with me. Sundays are my self-care days. I take it more easy. Um, today, I'm going to go to the gym. And I'm going to chat with y'all, give y'all a mini little apartment tour as well since the first time i've showed you it came a long way as you can see and i've done a lot of decorating and it's turned out really really cute and i like you guys to see it so i'm gonna update y'all on how i've been doing and what's been on my mind and this it's everything a little mixture of my sunday and also just catching up with you guys so i'll be back once i get dressed for my workout clothes so I got my workout gear on. Sundays I clean too, so I'm about to clean up everything around here. And then I'll show y'all where I'm gonna be at the workout today. And I'm gonna give you a little mini apartment tour and everything else I've been up to. Today I'm feeling a little sluggish. I ain't gonna lie to you, but we gonna get through it. So I've been bulking up I'm just gaining weight, doing my glute exercises, working on getting my glute bigger. I used to be thicker than this. It'll be on the extra thick. Watch. <laughs> that motherfucking dump truck coming. <laughs> but I'm about to straighten up and I'll be hopping in the car with y'all and talking, talking some smack in a little bit. So, what's up, guys? I actually decided. Wait a Stop. My bad, that's my dog. I'm gonna show y'all her. But I actually decided to walk over to this park with my workout gear on. This is what it is, y'all. My little, my little baby. I don't got no kids. This is my child, y'all. Y'all don't see more of her. I decided to work out over here. I walked over here, so I'm gonna look for a bench to do some workouts on. Now, I'll show a little bit of my workout, but I wanna stay focused, so I'm not gonna show the whole thing. But let me get to my spot that I want to be at and I'll talk to y'all for a bit. But I want to show y'all a little bit of the walk too. It's super pretty over here. It's Lil Lala. Yeah. I'm just gonna vibe out to this one. I know shit envy, why we gotta be enemies? It ain't all about the fame, I really love the crash. These people play games, that's why the game ain't for the week. I'm just focused on the back, ain't got no time to cheat. And I'll always keep it real, they can't say I deceive. He said you love me, you ain't showing that shit, yeah. But he said, I'm just a little too touchy, I'm just a little too wifey. He said, he don't deserve me at all. No, not at all, he only takes me. So, Jesus Christ. Jumping all in these leaves. So I made it to a spot that I like. Y'all, I love fall. I love the colors. I love everything. She's like going insane over there, about to have a heart attack. Child, calm down. Doing some more. But I'm gonna work out by this bench. Do some glute work over here. But I know I've been MIA, at least on the vlog side here, and I've been doing more so music and stuff. But I took the time to actually experience things and get out more, spend some more time with the family that I have that moved down here now. You know, grandma lives down here. I'm actually taking the time to like take it all in and I'd be so much, I don't know, I guess capturing everything. Like, I'm sure y'all realize I'm, I'm still very private. Yeah, I'm on social media and stuff. I'm still, I share certain things. I don't know everything about me. But I'm always been like that though. Like, I don't know. But it's beautiful out here. And through that time of me taking the time to actually be experience things, it gave me time to think about what I want to do with my channel, how I want to expand it, how I want to work on myself, how I want to really just expand a lot of different parts of my life so recently I started school as well because I dropped out um actually because I graduated in 2020 I had dropped out um a little bit after caught COVID and my grandfather passed and everything it was too much for me so I just gave up on it entirely so going back I'm in real estate school right now I started that about a couple months ago 
been consistent with that. I'm loving it. I'm online. The next we're working on, working on going back to school for another thing. I'll let y'all find that out over time. But getting myself prepared for some endeavors I plan to do. And also just to be on the, the business smart savvy side in this industry. So with that being said, it just really helped me to appreciate and actually understand where I'm at because I'm actually very critical on myself and I always want myself to be better, which is not a bad thing per se. However, when you don't allow yourself to enjoy what's actually going on around you in the midst of it, that's where it becomes a problem. And I actually took the time to just be present and really enjoy where I'm at. I'm where I'm at because this is where I'm supposed to be. When I go through periods, when I feel like things aren't necessarily working out entirely the way I want them to, those really be the times where it's time for me to reflect on my mood and to be more clear about them, I realize. So that's the period I've been going through. But everything's been happening for a reason. I ain't gave up on nothing. I ain't never gave up on it. I'm always working on something. I'm actually going to write today. Do some, I'm write some remix actually to post. So I think I'll capture that too on my, on my story. I mean, yeah, on my stories too. And a little bit of that on my vlog here. Look at Weta. <laughs> Hi, Weta. Hi, Duty. Hey, Duty. She's very happy. <laughs> but I'm going to start working out. But I've just been going through just like a revelation with myself, learning things about myself. I'm still learning, but it's just going harder. Everything ain't ever perfect, but everything, I'm definitely feeling like I'm in alignment. That's for sure. So I'm gonna let y'all see some of this workout. Okay, so I wasn't able to find a good spot. I forgot to bring my tripod with me over here. I just was so ready to go on this walk. Fresh outdoor workout today. It's just so beautiful. Right? It's just something about the world for me too. I love that you. I'm sure I realize that about me. But I'll see y'all once I get home. I'm gonna soak. Self care Sunday. I'll soak my body. I'll rinse off first, of course. Because to me, tell me if I feel the same way. I feel like if you take a bath, you need to shower first because. That's really dirty if you think about it. You like sitting in dirt if you don't. That's just me personally. Tell me if y'all agree. I always been talking and wash my body, wash my ass. <laughs> and then I hop in the bath and I put everything in. I put body, I put a bath oil in. Um, little apple cider vinegar. And some extra salt. I soak in that, and then I get out, do another, another quick little bit of salt. I tip the right in, I'll just dab myself dry. The oils that were in the tubs will stay in me. Oh, look at this skin. By the way, I've been working on my skin too. We're glowing. I still get breakouts occasionally, but who cares? It's, it's natural. I don't care about showing that stuff. But now, about to head back home. So, we currently are in my kitchen. A little bit of mess. I made a roast. The girl be throwing down. I'm gonna do some videos on me cooking. But, that's my kitchen. Right now, I am about to take my shot of apple cider vinegar. I take a shot of apple cider vinegar, diluted with some water, and then you can straight once a week. Help to balance out the pH of your body. It's super good for you. Always get the one with the mother in it. A lot of good benefits for that, but I do that just to kind of help my body. It's also on the cell phone, so that helps with anybody know. Ladies, that helps with your pH too. Of course, not directly. Don't ever just pour apple cider vinegar directly on or drink it directly. It's nasty and it's very harmful. The um, acidic levels are very high, so you're going to burn the hell out of it. Next, since I finished out my workout, 
and get some good old protein. I take my supplements because I know, okay, look, fun fact about me, I don't eat completely clean, I'm not gonna lie to you. One thing about me, I'm not gonna act like it's perfect on here because I'm not. And I still eat that with that alone. But I make sure it's a good mixture. Well, I still eat what I want. I still make sure I include vegetables in my diet every day, as well as some fruit or some type of fiber I can get in there, some yogurt. You still gotta balance it out. And that's why I also take my supplements. I take vitamins every day. Um, I take my protein after my workouts. I eat a lot of meat, so oftentimes I'll get my protein is enough. Sometimes I'm if I don't, I'll go towards the protein powder. I'm also in both the season, so I'm trying to up my calorie intake right now. So, yeah, that's going on right now. This shit is right here because these motherfuckers won't fix it. I'm not on the high priority list, apparently. But also, too, I don't want nobody to know where I live, so. <laughs> Sorry for the weirdos that be watching me. But let me show y'all a little bit of my place. This is my woven, woven bar, my bookshelf, good energy in here, a little bit of the hallway, this is quick, I'm not doing an official um, tour because I'm still not done decorating, but this is where I'm at so far, this is the living room, a little area. Second bedroom is my office space, so this is gonna be studio space in here. I'm still working on that. Taking my time, I'll just show this area. Coming together very nice. Also, I wanna show this quote that I posted in here. I, I just love it. The quote I hung up in here, that's gonna be in the back wall. I'm gonna put a TV between the two. Put some lights and stuff, so be nice. But live the life you've always dreamed of. Be fearless in the face of adversity. Never stop learning. Use your imagination whenever possible. Recognize the beauty that surrounds you. Remember where you came from, but never lose sight of where you are going. I love that. I like to see positive things during the day. And you put it out in my day. Don't say, I have I, my bad day sometimes. I experience negative emotion, but I like to see some positive in my, in my place. Then, this is my bedroom. Look at the waist. I'm still not done, but this is where we're at with it. But a little quick little mini tour, not done. But now that I'm done with that, I'm about to shower. I'm gonna drink my protein powder once I get off of here and actually stay focused on what I need to do. And this is my blossom bubble bath. Got some oils in it. I make my own, I put my own natural um, body oils and lightweight oil actually so it doesn't stain the tub because I'm so white in here. Um, let me put it in the decoration and I'll show that off. My bathroom's actually very cute. Very cute. Just a little, little song song, a little song song. So I do that. My body oil mixture. This was an old mixture. I kept the season and it made more. But I use this. I also use this on my, my kitty. Keep her moisturized. And yeah, I put a few drops of these in the tub. A little some Epsom salt. I can't give y'all the drip on them. Wow, I keep myself smelling extra good all the time. I want to bite hockey at me, you know what I'm saying? It's that, it's that shit's naive as crap you would say. <laughs> but I will, I will be checking in with y'all when I'm done and I'm getting ready talk a little bit more with y'all and then that'll be pretty much my day with y'all. At least a little glimpse of my day before I get moving with the rest of everything I'm gonna do today. But just want to check in with y'all and now I wanna be clean. I'm sorry to day. I'm gonna check in a little bit. Got the shower, I did my hair, feel great, moisturized, watching my watching Kevin Gates in the background. That didn't be crazy. <laughs> I like the show though, like y'all on YouTube. So what it edit. 
Right now, I'm waiting for my godmom to come actually right now. And we're gonna chill for a bit, but I really just been working on bringing that work balance in my life. And I figured it out, plus my social life and also my music and everything else. I'm trying to get in motion, just finding that balance for myself and continue to work every day on just getting more knowledgeable on the things I'm trying to do more forward, moving forward and being more, um, being more clear with, with my days of how I can get closer to where I want to be is what I've been working on. I've been okay though. You know, everything ain't perfect for everybody. I have my ups and downs sometimes, you know, I have my moments, with some sad sometimes. Sometimes I just need some me time. And that's honestly what I've taken. I've taken some time off to really just get closer with myself, learn myself some more. And I'm glad I did that. Like I said, I was putting too much pressure on myself to just keep posting consistently, but no time to just me time. But now that I got this me time, ready to get back in mode, back in mode. So, so content's gonna get better. And I'm gonna keep going with this, you know? It's fall, one of my, one of my favorite times of the year is I love the colors. So I'm gonna be out here doing some more stuff, more content, more vlogs so y'all can see what's going on with me. And of course, more music. The EP definitely still is coming. Be patient. I ain't even, no, I ain't gonna say nothing. I'm just gonna see. It's gonna pop up though. But yeah, with that, I've switched out songs on it, chose other songs for other things, and it's gonna be good. That's all I know. I'm putting my best foot forward with it. Really want to show my wordplay, show that I'm a real artist, show my writing skills off, melodies, because I know I'm hard as fuck. It's just, I just got to keep putting that work in, and it's only a matter of time, and someone notices me, but I'm, I'm just, I'm in a happier place mentally and everything now. I really am. I'm happy I moved out here and took the leap was scared everything wasn't perfect i had that much money when i came down here but i had a vision and i just made sure i just followed through just followed through but thank y'all for tuning in there's more content on the way make sure you like and subscribe and sh and tell me what you think down below about the different things i was talking about in this video your your opinions on it or any personal experience you might have had with what I'm talking about. But I love y'all fam, my supporters. So I will be seeing y'all later. Peace.